confess your faults one to another and pray one for another that he may be healed. The effectual fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much. James 5.16 Welcome to Philadelphia Christian Church and we thank you for choosing Philadelphia to worship. If this is your first time visiting with us, make yourself at home. And for those who are from out of state, please visit our Welcome Center in the foyer for a token of love to you. And for our online family all over the world, thank you so much for joining us. We pray the presence of God will be in your home or wherever you are. This week is a regular week at Philadelphia with Monday through Friday noonday prayer. If you are available on your lunch break, stop by and stand in agreement with the saints in praying for the world, the United States, Louisiana, and the church. If you missed the last Bible study, download the Philly app right from your app store. Available on Android and Apple devices, just search for PCC Lafayette. A school of prayer will be at 6.15 p.m. on Thursday evening. Be with us for corporate prayer and learn how to pray and stand in agreement with the saints. This is where many of us learn how to pray to the Father out loud and how to come boldly before His throne of grace. See you there. The Free Indeed Recovery Experience, the FIRE Ministry, is this Thursday at 7 p.m. with a continuation of their current series, Letting Go of Besetting Sins. See you then. The Hebrew Softball League has started. Games will be played on Saturdays from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. and Sundays from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m., all held at Arsenal Park behind Celebrity Theater in Broussard. So get ready to join us on the diamond or in the stands. Let's take a moment and check out our next Philly testimony. What's up, Philly? We back again. Have Brother Carl here. Brother Carl, I have the question of the day for you. And that is, do you remember who first invited you to Philadelphia? Uh, my brother, uh, uh, Dedrick Charles, invited me to Philadelphia at a Bible study. I got you. So tell me about your first experience here at Philadelphia. Um, it was just, uh, uh, just a life-changing experience. Uh, you know, pastor was reading the word. Uh, it, it applied to my heart, and I've been forever changed, man. I got you. I got you. Philly, there it is. Brother Carl. Love y'all. Love you, bro. Brother Carl. Good job, too. man. I'm trying, man. Glory to the Lord. Right now, it's time for the good news of the week. All right, right now, I want to give a special happy birthday to my mama, Miss Marilyn Hope Malvo, celebrating her 54th birthday. Glory to God, July 28th. Happy birthday, mom. Now, I want you to do right now, just smile and wave, mom. Smile and wave. <laughs> Hallelujah. Also, let's give a congratulations to Jennifer Harvey for obtaining her residential contractor's license for the state of Louisiana. Hebrews are moving on up. Congratulations to the Harvey family. The Harvey family also has some birthdays to celebrate. Sister Jenna Harvey celebrating her birthday on today, July 28th, and Mrs. Jennifer Harvey will be celebrating her birthday on July 30th. Happy birthday to the Harveys. Let's give a happy belated birthday to Brother Darius Moore, who made 33 on July 22nd. Happy birthday. The Romar family also has some birthdays this month. They would like to wish Madison a happy 16th birthday. And also, let's give a happy 40th birthday to Misha Romar, LaFille, and Mackenzie. Happy birthday to the Romars. For your good news to be featured on the Good News of the Week, please email to phillyoffice1 at yahoo.com. That's phillyoffice1 at yahoo.com. We must receive it by 3 p.m. on Thursdays to be featured on Sundays and Tuesdays announcements. Well, Philly family, those were your announcements. Stand to your feet right now. It's worship time. 